Good Good morning. Yes, sir. I have your other gift when you want to see. Oh, nice. Nice. So I don't know when you're in the area or whatever. Let me know and we'll meet up. Cool. Very cool. (laughs) Even this afternoon would be good. Okay, I'm done. Sorry, interrupt. All right. That's good. (laughs) Um, Welcome to a new seven week period of rosaries. Yay. Welcome back after a Sabbath of not having to get up so early. It was a nice sleep in. Anyways, we're beginning with the joyful mysteries. The Blessed Virgin Mary promised to St. Dominic and to all who follow that whatever you ask in the rosary will be granted. She left for all Christians 15 promises to those who recite the Holy Rosary as imparted to St. Dominic and Blessed Alan de la Roche. Whoever shall faithfully serve me by the recitation of the rosary shall receive signal graces. I promise my special protection and the greatest graces to all those who shall recite the rosary. The rosary shall be a powerful armor against hell. It will destroy vice, decrease sin, and defeat heresies. The rosary will cause virtue and good works to flourish. It will obtain for souls the abundant mercy of God. It will withdraw the hearts of men from the love of the world and his vanities and will lift them to the desire for eternal things. Oh, that souls would sanctify themselves by this means. The soul which recommends itself to me by the recitation of the rosary shall not perish. Whoever shall recite the rosary devoutly, applying himself to the consideration of its sacred mystery, shall never be conquered by misfortune. God will not chastise him in his justice, and he shall not perish by an unprovided death. If he be just, he shall remain in the grace of God and become worthy of eternal life. Whoever shall have a true devotion for the rosary shall not die without the sacraments of the church. Those who are faithful to recite the rosary shall have during their life and at their death the light of God and the plenitude of his graces. At the moment of death, they shall participate in the merits of the saints in paradise. I shall deliver from purgatory those who have been devoted to the rosary. The faithful children of the rosary shall merit a high degree of glory in heaven. You shall obtain obtain all you ask of me by the recitation of the rosary. All those who propagate the Holy Rosary shall be aided by me in their necessities. I have obtained from my divine Son that all the advocates of the Rosary shall have for intercessors the entire celestial court during their life and at the hour of death. All who recite the Rosary are my sons and daughters and brothers and sisters of my only Son, Jesus Christ. Devotion of my Rosary is a great sign of predestination. O Immaculata, I renew my consecration to you. May all that I am and have belong entirely to you. This morning, we will be praying through the Joyful Mysteries, beginning with the Apostles' Creed, followed by our intentions. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, Amen. Amen. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, Creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, His only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, and suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell. On the third day, He rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of God, the Father Almighty. From there, He will come to judge the living. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. Amen. Amen. Let us glorify our Savior who chose the Virgin Mary for his mother. Let us ask him, may your mother intercede for us, Lord. Son of justice, the Immaculate Virgin was the white dawn announcing your rising. Grant that we may always live in the light of your coming. Savior of the world, by your redeeming might, you preserved your mother beforehand from all stain of sin. Keep watch over us, lest we sin. You are our Redeemer, who made the Immaculate Virgin Mary your purest home and the sanctuary of the Holy Spirit. Make us temples of your Spirit forever. King of kings, you lifted up your mother, body, and soul into heaven. Help us fix our eyes on things above. Father, you prepared the Virgin Mary to be the worthy mother of your Son. You let her share beforehand in the salvation of Christ, would bring by his death, and kept her sinless from the first moment of her conception. Help us by her prayers to live in your presence without sin. We ask this through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. Continue. 
Oh, sorry. We are praying today for an increase of faith, hope, and charity. We are praying that grace and peace would be ours in abundance through the knowledge of God and of Jesus Christ, our Lord. We are praying that Lent may be a favorable time for our transformation according to the logic of love and solidarity as St. Maximilian teaches us. And we also lift as our intention with this rosary, the prayer of St. Paul from the book of Ephesians, chapter 3, verses 14 through 21. For this reason, I bow my knees before the Lord. A father from whom every family in heaven and on earth is named that according to the riches of his glory he may grant you to be strengthened with power through his spirit in your inner being so that christ may dwell in your hearts without through faith that you being rooted and guarded in love may have strength to comprehend with all the saints thank you what is the breadth and length and height and depth and to know the love of G christ that surpasses knowledge, that you may be filled with all the fullness of God. Now to him who is able to do far more abundantly than all we can ask or think, according to the power at work within us, to him be glory in the church and in Christ Jesus throughout all generations forever and ever. Amen. Whew, that's a long sentence. Yeah. We lift up both the corporal and spiritual prosperity of our parishes and the diocese of Salt Lake City. We ask for wisdom for Bishop Solis to shepherd God's flock. And we lift up the intentions of Fathers Vidal, Joe Wheaton, Martin, Sternhagen, Cummins, and for the repose of the soul of Father Rene. We are praying for a hundred year vision for flame keepers. We lift up the daily Zoom rosaries asking for an increase inwardly and expansion outwardly. We lift up Annabelle's angels labors for 24 seven prayer and worship. We lift up the Burning Ones Young Adult Internship. We lift up the Final Quest Book Reading, a tool for discipleship. And we lift up the Joseph Company praying for local businesses and workers. We lift up the bi-weekly Power Pods. We lift up the bi-weekly Family Fast. We lift up the monthly Great Paradox Podcast. And we lift up the monthly Flame Keepers Breakfast at American Legion. And we lift up the annual men's retreat and it's well you know what i didn't hold on a second we're missing a uh we lift up the did we already uh, let's see we lift up the monthly um misery cordea outreach amen hey is that Will breakfast it, this weekend no, no, no. That's uh, the, April 10th, the okay, weekend after you. Easter. Yeah, That's what I thought. All right, thanks. All right. We lift up the uh, monthly Misery Cordia outreach, and we lift up the annual men's retreat and its preparation. We ask for lost souls to return to the family of God. Hey, that should be we pray. Like. We pray for our enemies, those who desire to do the greatest harm that they would receive a revelation of God's love. We lift up all unspoken family issues and ask for relational, spiritual, and or financial health issues. We ask for authority over the fear of death, authority over the spirit of the fear of death, and authority over death itself to manifest through our lives. We ask for authority over every demon from hell, the same way Enoch had overcome every wicked spirit and had authority in the earth. We pray that the fruit of your sufferings, Jesus, may be renewed in our souls by the faithful remembrance of your passion. And may your love increase in our hearts, in our hearts each day. In our hearts each day uh, until we see you in eternity. You who are the treasury of every real good and every joy, which we beg thee to grant us, O sweetest Jesus in heaven. Amen. We also want to continue to lift up the needs of our nation, especially the needs of those suffering the most through the current COVID-19 situation. Please protect America and make her a burning and shining lamp for the Lord. And now let us unify our minds and spirits in a prayer for the United States of America, composed by His Excellency, Archbishop Carlo Maria Vigano. 
Almighty and eternal God, King of kings and Lord of lords, graciously turn your gaze to us who invoke you with confidence. Bless us, citizens of the United States of America, grant peace and prosperity to our nation. Illuminate those who govern us so that they may commit themselves to the common good and respect for your holy law. Protect those who, defending the inviolable principles of the natural law and your commandments, must face the repeated assaults of the enemy of the human race. Keep in the hearts of your children courage for the truth, love for virtue, and perseverance in the midst of trials. Make our families grow in the example that our Lord has given us, together with his most holy mother and St. Joseph in the home of Nazareth. Give to our fathers and mothers the gift of strength to educate wisely the children with which you have blessed them. Give courage to those who in spiritual combat fight the good fight as soldiers of Christ against the furious forces of the children of darkness. Keep each one of us, O Lord, in your most sacred heart, and above all, he whom your providence has placed at the head of our nation. Bless the President of the United States of America, so that aware of his responsibility and his duties, he may be a knight of justice, a defender of the oppressed, a firm bulwark against his, your enemies, and a proud supporter of the children of light. Place the United States of America and the whole world under the mantle of the Queen of Victories, our unconquered leader in battle, the Immaculate Conception. It is thanks to her and through your mercy that the hymn of praise rises to you, O Lord, from the children whom you have redeemed in the most precious blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. And now if anyone has an intention they would like to lift up, please do so. Uh, I'll meet your phone. My phone do fall. Do so. I'd like to lift up uh, Michael specifically, um, homeless man that's dealing with a lot of things in his life and definitely um, struggling with good and bad, trying to figure out where he wants to be. So just that God will enlighten him. And then all homeless to take care of the homeless, make sure that they're finding food and shelter. It's temperatures dropped again so that they find warmth and a place to stay. We pray for our catechumens worldwide, the elect, Lord, and your spirit down. Set their hearts on fire for you. Mm -hmm. And let the leadership filled with your spirit direct them properly and with you, God, leading the way. Also for the young, the youth, that their hearts on fire, bring them back to you, God, worldwide, a revival of youth in our church. Amen. Let it begin here, Lord, in, uh, in this region. God, that there, I asked for open doors to get on to, to reach the high school campuses and the college campuses. Lord, we lift up uh, Jackson and, uh, and just other relationships that you have to connect us with, that we would be able to reach them with love, with the power of the Holy Spirit, with the word of God, with signs and wonders. God, that we would actually be able to help transform lives, not just bring them to you, but help grow them, not just catch the fish, but to clean them, to raise people up to maturity. God, that revival would break forth, that our society would be changed, transformed, Lord. We ask for revival, real revival, transformation of lives in the kingdom of God, your will being done here on earth as it is in heaven, that, that, that heaven would invade earth right here in our region, that we would get to participate in it and see it, Lord. I lift up the Thursday night um, circles meetings and just Daniel and all those who will be impacted by that, Lord. Um, and everything that we're doing, that we're putting our hands to, all these ministries that we've lifted up, reaching out to the homeless power pods, growing people in their spiritual disciplines, all of these Zoom roses. God, I ask for an increase of prayer people. We've been praying, Lord, 
for more people, uh, more laborers. And so, God, I pray that, that there would be a raising up of more people who desire to pray the rosary and be impacted by our Zoom rosaries as we expand, Lord. Thank you for this Burning Ones internship and Devin's faithfulness and uh, those of us who are stewarding his internship. And we ask that, you would, that we would be faithful and that you would send more interns who would grow, Lord. But God, we ask for revival, revival, souls being saved communities transformed and i pray for lost for people who are suffering family who have lost ones in their own children their own mothers sisters aunts uncles who have walked away or who are not yet part of the family of faith god that this would be a year where where we would see people's families restored in christ And then just lift up the rosary in America. Ask Lord that you would cause America to be known for her devotion to the Blessed Virgin. God, I ask that you would use her to evangelize America, that you would draw hearts near to the Lord. Mm -hmm. And lift up, uh, yeah, just prayer in general. God, I just ask for the body of Christ to be drawn into prayer in America and actually all over the world, but specifically in America and specifically in Utah. Amen. Lord, Lord I pray you ask, Go ahead, John. No, Bob. Lord, I would ask that you would remove all of the evil principalities that have invaded our church, that they would be exposed and removed from their positions, mm -hmm. that there would be a, a complete cleansing of our hierarchy that impede the work of your holy spirit and we ask the same for our all our institutional governing bodies that the evil forces that have invaded and, and embedded themselves that they be exposed they be removed they be cleansed lord god do a complete cleansing of all of these institutions that they may free from the enemy, O oh God, and that your Holy Spirit would be a work. Praise you, Lord. Amen. 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 Praying for the will of the Blessed Mother in the service of the Blessed Mother for the glory of the King. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Jesus, Mary, and Joseph, we love you. Save the souls of the unborn children, all souls in purgatory, all priests and religious, and all marriages and families. Queen of the Most Holy Rosary. Pray for us. The first joyful mystery is the Annunciation. And before we pray, there our Father, followed by the Becket of Hail Mary, join with us for meditated purposes in the recitation of O Mary of all. Would you change that, women, please? 
Thank you. Bugs me. O oh, Mary of all women, you are the chosen one who ancient prophets promised would bear God's only son. All Hebrew generations prepared the way to thee that in your womb the God-man might come to set us free. O oh, Mary, you embody all God taught to our race for you are first and foremost in fullness of grace. We praise this wondrous honor that you gave birth to him who from you took humanity and saved us from our sin. The Annunciation, our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Jesus, Mary, and Joseph, we love you. Save the souls of the unborn children, all souls in purgatory, all priests and religious, and all marriages and families. Queen of the Most Holy Rosary, pray for us. The second joyful mystery is the visitation of the Blessed Virgin to Elizabeth. And before we pray, the Our Father, followed by the decade of Hail Mary, join with us for meditative purposes and the recitation of the Magnificat. Magnify the Lord, and my spirit hath rejoiced in God my Savior, for he hath record, regarded the humility of his handmaid. For behold, from henceforth all generations shall be call me blessed, for he that is mighty hath done great things unto me, and holy is his name. And his mercy is from generation to generation unto them that fear him. He hath showed strength with his arm, he hath scattered the proud in the imagination of their heart. He hath put down the mighty from their seat and hath exalted the humble. He hath filled the hungry with good things and the rich he hath sent away empty. He hath upholden his servant Israel being mindful of his mercy as he spake unto our fathers to Abraham and his seed forever. Glory be to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. The visitation of the Blessed Virgin to Elizabeth. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil, amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Jesus, Mary, and Joseph, we love you. Save the souls of the unborn children, all souls in purgatory, all priests and religious, and all marriages and families. Queen of the Most Holy Rosary, pray for us. The third joyful mystery is the nativity of our Lord. Before we pray to our Father, followed by the decade of Hail Mary, join with us for meditative purposes in the recitation of what child is this? What child is this who laid to rest on Mary's lap is sleeping, whom angels greet with anthems sweet while shepherds watch are keeping? This, this is Christ the King, whom shepherds guard and angels sing, haste, Haste to bring him laud, the babe, the son of Mary. Why lies he in such mean a state where ox and ass are feeding? Good Christians fear for sinners here, the silent word is pleading. Nails, spear shall pierce him through, the cross to be born for me, for you. Hail, hail the word made flesh, the babe, the son of Mary. To bring him, so bring him incense, gold and myrrh. Come, peasant king, to own him. The king of kings salvation brings. Let loving hearts enthrone him. Raise, raise a song on high. The virgin sings her lullaby. Joy, joy, for Christ is born, the babe, the son of Mary. The nativity of our Lord Jesus, our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. 
Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Jesus, Mary, and Joseph, we love you. Save the souls of the unborn children, all souls in purgatory, all priests and religious, and all marriages and families. Queen of the Most Holy Rosary, pray for us. The fourth joyful mystery is the presentation of Jesus in the temple. And before we pray the Our Father, followed by the decade of Hail Mary, join with us for meditative purposes in a reading of the presentation of Jesus in the temple. Mary and Joseph take the baby Jesus to Jerusalem to present him to the Lord. The presentation of Jesus in the temple is in fulfillment with the Jewish law that every firstborn male child must be taken to the temple and an animal must be offered as a sacrifice. That is why Joseph is usually artistically depicted in the scene holding a cage with two doves in it. The prophet Simeon and the prophetess Anna meet the Holy Family while at the temple in Jerusalem. Simeon had been told by God that he would see the Savior before he died. When Simeon sees baby Jesus, he takes him from Mary and holds him in his arms and praises God, proclaiming, Now thou dost dismiss thy servant, O Lord, according to thy word in peace, because my eyes have seen thy salvation. Simeon then blesses Mary and Joseph and prophesies to Mary. Behold, this child is set for the fall and for the resurrection of many in Israel, and for a sign which shall be contradicted, and thy own soul a sword shall pierce, that out of many hearts thoughts may be revealed. Even though this is a joyful occasion, you can see in the words of Simeon a foreshadow of the sorrows that will be shared between Jesus and his mother Mary. Now, um, excuse me, Mary suffered with Jesus from the beginning to the end. Anna also proclaims that this child, the baby Jesus, is the long-awaited Messiah. After all this, the Holy Family leaves Jerusalem and returns to Nazareth. There they live in peace and joy for many years before Jesus begins his public life. For the Bible says the child grew and waxed strong, full of wisdom and the grace of God was in him the presentation of jesus in the temple our father who art in heaven hallowed be thy name thy kingdom come thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil amen Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Jesus, Mary, and Joseph, we love you. Save the souls of the unborn children, all souls in purgatory, all priests and religious, and all marriages and families. Queen of the Most Holy Rosary, pray for us. The fifth joyful mystery is the finding of Jesus in the temple. And before we pray to our Father, follow by the decade of Hail Mary, join with us for meditative purposes in the recitation of chapter 2, verses 4 through 52 from the Gospel according to Luke. Each year, Jesus' parents went to Jerusalem for the Feast of Passover. And when he was 12 years old, they went up according to festival custom. After they had completed its days, as they were returning, the boy Jesus remained behind in Jerusalem, but his parents did not know it. Thinking that he was in the caravan, they journeyed for a day and looked for him among their relatives and acquaintances. But not finding him, they returned to Jerusalem to look for him. After three days, they found him in the temple, sitting in the midst of the teachers, listening to them and asking them questions. And all who heard him were astounded at his understanding and his answers. When his parents saw him, they were astonished, and his mother said to him, Son, may, why have you done this to us? Your father and I have been looking for you with great anxiety. And he said to them, Why were you looking for me? Did you not know that I must be in my father's house? But they did not understand what he said to them. He went down with them and came to Nazareth and was obedient to them. And his mother kept all these things in her heart. And Jesus advanced in wisdom and age and favor before God and man. The finding of Jesus in the temple. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord's with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Jesus, Mary, and Joseph, we love you. Save the souls of the unborn children, all souls in purgatory, all priests and religious, and all marriages and families. Queen of the Most Holy Rosary, pray for us. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother of Mercy, our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To thee do we cry, poor banished children of Eve. To thee we send up our sighs, mourning and weeping in this valley of tears. Turn then, most gracious advocate, thine eyes of mercy towards us, and after this our exile. Show unto us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus, O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary. Pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray, O God, whose only begotten Son, by his life, death, and resurrection, has purchased for us the rewards of eternal life. Grant, we beseech thee, that by meditating upon these mysteries of the most holy rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise through the same Christ our Lord. Amen. Remember, O most gracious Virgin Mary, that never was it known that anyone who fled to thy protection, implored thy help, or sought thy intercession was left unaided. Inspired by this confidence, I fly to thee, O Virgin of Virgins, my mother. To thee do I come, before thee I stand, sinful and sorrowful. O Mother of the Word incarnate, despise not my petitions, but in thy mercy hear and answer me. Amen. Praying for the intentions of the Pope, our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit, Amen. Amen.